Hello, welcome back. Last time the villain revealed himself, and if I'm not mistaken, this is probably the buggy presence from the info hut. So, you're here, I'm going through your little gauntlet that you've set up for me, and this could be the final room for all I know, but it might not be. I made some tweaks to the graphics, the uh, fear effect is eh, probably barely distinguishable, but it's a little bit different now. Alright, statue has awoken. More deadly gate. Can't bypass this. Okay. So I could have used different timing here. There's a bunch of poison. Statues doing things. I can wipe up some of the poison. Not really enough of it. I probably want to wait. Mm, that's not going to work, is it? Oh, it might. Let's see here. Can I... Mm, this might be doable. Not quite. Okay, there's, there's like, there's trickery I can totally do here. Okay, so if I wait for the slugs, they'll go all the way around there. I mean, I don't think I need to be particularly quick here. What if I simply would... Well, it's not gonna work. Okay, well, I got one idea at least. Let's see what happens. Mm, do I want to be over here? Not exactly. Oh, hold on, okay. So, if I let the slug hold back the statue a little bit. Then I would go... It's not quite what I want. This is like close, but it's not right. Hmm. Well, I can turn a slug. That might be productive. It's hard to tell. So, now I have a problem with uh, this tile. And if I just bring this statue over... Oh, 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 this is similar to what I want. Yeah, that's pretty close. If I could have... what if I had pre-dropped this tile here? I don't have time to. Okay, what if I did that in the north? Something like... Well, Slug turned in a way I didn't want it to. How do I want to do this? It's a little hard to tell. If I'd done that, like, one turn earlier... This could be close to what I want. Yes. Okay, I pre-dropped. I think this will work. I go... I, I go... I go... No, I, I go... I go... Uh... How did I do that in the north? I had... I, I managed to get things to happen the way I wanted. Did I have more distance? I probably had more distance. Must have had more distance. Hmm. Let's try this timing. No, that just just doesn't do what I want. I'm like I'm never getting the statue to sweep that up now. So like the distance I needed looked a little more like. Okay, so ignoring slugs for a second. What I did with the statue was... not that. Hmm. 
trying to get it trapped on this side of the, uh, the pit. Well, okay, so what if it's trapped on the other side? And then I, uh, do some of the... Oh, I might have something here, actually. That's a clear path. Now, if I could get past the statue, it'd be great. Do you suppose I could arrange such a thing? Perhaps the slugs could help. Just kind of hold it in place. Somehow, when going the wrong way around. Hmm. See, now they're just stuck there together forever. But I like the slide I did there, that was pretty cool. I could have done that without dropping all of my trapdoors. Let's just leave that one alone. I can't. Well, I could leave here? No, that's too far, not in the right direction. Man, how did I... I don't know what I just did. That could be a problem. No, no, I know what I just did. Okay, so... Go here. Wait a moment. Drop, let's say, this. No, don't drop that. In fact, don't drop that either. Well, I kind of have to. Okay, drop this, then. That... No, don't. Dang it. Okay. Well, I can't get that far. Okay, so if I drop things like this... And yeah, I just, I run out of spaces, so... Mm. So I have to leave specifically this one, but the problem is if I leave specifically that one, then I can't make it around here. Okay, let's try that same idea in the north, because I get a little bit more time to make it there. Yeah, that might be good enough, actually. It might be better, actually. Okay, so I need some slug disruption. It probably needs to happen a little earlier. Ah, uh, not necessarily. Let's just hold slugs up. Kind of here-ish. Whoa. Well, all right, statue, you can do that if you want, I guess. Uh, no, slugs are gonna jam each other up. I just want them close, but not, like, actually touching. That might be good enough. So now the idea would be here. Let me give myself a little more. Oh, now that'll let the statue through, though. Don't want that. Okay, so what I want is to do this. So I still have a way out. Ah, but the direction of rotation isn't right. Can I still work with it, though? Not with this spacing. No. Like, there was a very specific spacing I achieved. That's no good. Okay. Well, I wish I knew what I had done in the south. Let's just try and recreate whatever I did. It involved bumping into a slug on the way. Okay, you did that and sent that one over. It's gonna sit there for a second and then kind of go on a little rampage. This might still be acceptable. You'll end up in this cycle, which is fine for me. What I need is for that slug over there to make a... I don't think it's gonna make it where I want it. Well, no, hang on, I can just... Uh, I have the wrong trapdoors dropped. I can do this, but now I'm trapped. 
Well, also, statue is not ever cleaning this up because I needed two slugs for that. Okay, so pretty tricky. Not sure what I'm gonna do to make this happen. Can I just send you across and then get away? Not without dropping more, and okay, so so hang on. So let's try once again to have slugs in the way. Thanks, slugs, for being in the way. Slug will move before statue, right? Yes. Okay, that's pretty good. What if I do this? That's pretty good, except it's not. I don't think there's any way I'm sliding him over here. The slugs won't sink up at this spot. That's what I'm trying to make happen. I can change their synchronization by, like, opening this up, but then that just brings the statue to me. Yes, yeah, statue's found me now. Okay. So it just has to clear a track for me, then the track has to stay clear for the duration that I get over there, and I have to get away from the statue somehow. Like, it feels like the best thing would be, statue clears the track, I put it behind a set of trapdoors, I zip through there before the track is re-infested. Like, the, putting the statue behind the trapdoors part of that just isn't seemingly happening. Or did it here? Kinda. Can I, like, switch sides and make that work? If this could have been dropped, that would be great. Can I maybe... That's gone. I can't do anything here, though. And, like, my, my path's about to get reinfested. Okay, having done that... Alright, a path is clear, however... Uh, can I let the slugs go? And have the statue, like, clean up after them sufficiently that I can escape? Or... Better... No, 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 here we go, I can trap him behind this, check it. So yeah, sluggles, you just lock yourselves up, thank you. Ah... Uh, Problem is, I can't get the statue to me without dying. Okay, so did I have a chance to do... Yeah, 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 okay, so... Here we go, here we go. This functions. Okay. No, it doesn't. No, I don't get any time for that. Never mind. Dang. Like, I'm so close here, but it's not... It's not right. Like, if I don't have any width on this... I mean, let's try an approach like just locking the statue up behind the slugs for a moment. I think that did it. Okay. Well, I found a way. Good enough for me. Okay. Oh, here we go. Ah. So... You are vulnerable. Except you're not, because this is pacified. So we can talk to each other. I can give you a little boop. But it won't hurt either of us. Alright. So, you are defeated. If I do this... There's a sacrifice altar here. <laughs> there's a down and there's a... Okay, so that would open... So there's a path down. This is the kill route. This is the no kill route. Okay, so hang on. So first of all... Oh. 
I want to see both. And given the mission of the, uh, the world, I think it makes the most sense to do the kill route first and then end with the no-kill route. All right. So if I want you sacrificed, I go here, I do this, and I've made a kill and I have lost. Can't activate that waypoint. Except, right, if I come back, I can get to it. Ah! <laughs> Bad ending. <laughs> okay, that's pretty good. <laughs> Alright, so, that's why I made that save. I want to restore. Yep, and I'm... Oh, I'm not actually stuck here. But, that is a rule-breaking... Uh, I'm currently in a rule-breaking state, so I'd like to restore to start of this. All right, so now this room is known, but not explored on this um, this current playthrough. Okay, so let's make a decision. How do I do things otherwise? This will release the bomb bug. So it can get away, and it can go to the rip zone. All right, you are saved. I have walked away. All right. Oh, that was kind of fun. All right, so we got the smiley face here. <laughs> yeah, I'm the hero. Oh, also, that was kind of fun. Let's see that again. The way that I've, I've never actually seen this myself before. I've never walked into a signpost at the room edge and seen the text box kind of like adjust like that. That's fun. Okay, I mean, it's not that fancy, but it's, it's fun to see. You know, it starts centered and then it has to, has to edge itself over as this thing gets closer to the edge. Like, I didn't, I didn't actually realize that this was responsive to the room transition, but that's just, that's just the way I set it up, apparently. Good for me. All right. So, we got a happy dance here, and, um... Oh boy, I am just gonna get mobbed. Got my mob of fans here, just kind of making it a little hard to get around. I'll shake your hand, and your hand, and your hand. Slugs don't have hands. But, okay, well, um... The procession will go by, and I'll get a chance to move. Okay. Well, that's a cool little celebration. The end! Yeah, that's a heart! Okay, so I guess 42 rooms was the number. Alright, so this screen's gonna look funny. Uh... In a lot of ways. Okay, so I was thinking at one point, like, what is the the clear graph going to look like when no rooms are cleared? I should make sure it works when literally no rooms are cleared. So it looks like it's showing me all of the rooms that have no monsters in here. Because this counts as having been cleared just by being through it. And there were only five of those. Yeah, I'm not like 100% sure what it does if there is zero rooms in one of the graph things. Here's what time spent. Right, these are all red except for the ones that were, um, that had no monsters in them. Because, like, a room is red if I've visited it, but not actually cleared it. So all red is what I want to see. Uh, rooms by visit order would be the most accurate way to look at this. Trailblazer took me the most time. I'm surprised because I thought I spent longer on, yeah, all around me. But no, Trailblazer was the bigger one. Okay, so yeah, this is the most useful graph. And like, this graph often isn't great for other worlds, but for this particular one, it's, it's the best way to look at it. So good, I'm glad I have it in here. I could change this to logarithmic if I want, and yeah, you can see a little better there, I guess. Sure. The, um, like, the relative, like, which is longer than the other is still the same. Okay, yeah, so, the ship, I spent 27 seconds there. Info hut, northward ascent, around the bend, scanner. I'm wondering about, like, eh, I don't know if there's a better way I could show that. Like, with a little bit of minimap around it or something? Nah, it's fine as it is. Sneak shuffle, those two where I got stuck a little bit. This highlight against the red isn't isn't the most standout, but I guess I can see where it is. Yeah, right. But this was in visit order, so this is this is just how things went. 
Skip the Pit took some time on the return trip. That was complicated. Which one was distressed? Oh yeah. The Sand Key, the Oasis. Right, the Snow Zone. Mm hmm. Trailblazer, yeah, that. I guess I did take quite a while to find a viable path there. That's fair. Sticky Cave was a bit of work. Blocked was neat. A swamp, I guess. I forgot that was the name of the thing. <laughs> World's not quite sure what it is. <laughs> Pine swamps are a thing. I've been to one. That's a real thing. Uh, or cedar swamps or something. I don't know. Some kind of evergreen, something or other. My... No, no, no. Okay, I was looking at the wrong... Yeah, so once again, this color... This is not standing out to my eyes against the red. I thought this was the highlighted one, I thought my cursor was desynced, so no, okay. I, I guess I need to change that color to something that stands out against both green and red? White? An outline around the bar, that's what I should do. An outline around the bar, probably. Probably. Maybe. Something like that. Anyway, which one was in and out? Oh yeah, this one. That was neat. I pass. Took me longer than I thought. Right, because I had some shuffling to do. 1 minute 48, that's not that long. Right, yeah, logarithmic. Let's put this back in linear. I, I just get a better idea like that, I think. Blindfold? Yeah? Yeah, because like in logarithmic, it does kind of make it look like blindfold took only twice as long as bypass, even though it was more than five times as long. Okay. Well, they're both options. Uh, very fancy mansion, marsh, bilge. So yeah, let's hope I didn't make any accidental kills that I actually kept. Uh, it's, there's video evidence if I did. Just, I don't think there were any that I didn't notice, but it's certainly possible it could have happened. All around me, yeah, this felt like the trickiest room in the thing. Like, I took longer on Trailblazer, but this this was hardest room for me, I would say. A to B went extremely... well... Push comes to shove... How did that go? Yeah, I just had trouble finding a viable path. Okay, great. Cool stuff. And yes, yeah, frowny face doesn't show up here. You can't have frowny face on this graph, that's impossible. Uh, strictly speaking, I don't think it is. You could go there and then waypoint back. Yeah, so my misdeeds, if I had actually killed the villain, sure, he'd respawn, but, but if I had killed him, I would still see my misdeed on this graph. So this is what it's supposed to look like. Great. Okay, well, this was fun. Cool little uh, honor system thing. Had to... Had to add some additional rules and enforce them myself, but I, I love that this exists. Like, just the sheer creativity of making this happen in this game. Just things that I couldn't possibly have imagined. Alright, that was great. Next time, another world. I'll see you then!